This video is only intended for illustrating the work stages and does not replace the official installation and operating instructions. The installation and operating instructions as well as, in particular, the safety instructions they contain must be read before starting work and followed during work. Renew the brake shoes as soon as the brake lining has worn down to 2 mm. The brake lining thickness can easily be checked via a monitoring opening in the brake plate without removing the wheel and the hub. Before the brake drum is pulled off, the brake shoes must be reset by turning the adjusting bolt. Then the axle nut is unscrewed and the wheel hub removed. Next, unhook the clamping and return springs. Then remove the expanding lock and the brake shoes. The return spring of the reversing mechanism is exchanged. Pay particular attention to the ease of movement of the swivel cam in this case. The moving parts should be painted with copper slip at the bearing points. The new brake shoes are installed in reverse order. It is important to insert the expanding lock the right way round. At the end of the installation, the axle nut is tightened to the correct torque and the wheel hub knocked in. To ensure perfect function, the brake must be readjusted after the installation. For your safety, use only genuine BPW spare parts. 